Hey guys, for the first time in a long time, I got trucks and I'm gonna review them. I got two new trucks yesterday and I would've made this video sooner, but um, the power went out in my neighborhood. It was out last night when I got these, but you know, the store still had power, so I went out there because I, I needed to do something because we don't have Wi-Fi and for some reason the um, data just wouldn't work with the power out and it's still not working as of when I'm filming this video. So this might be out later then I'm filming it right now, which is going to be, but because we have no service and yeah. So <clears throat> I wanted to get these open. Um, like I said, in my update video, I found mix 17 at, <coughs> sorry about that, at Meyer, which is just, if you don't know what Meyer is, go watch my older videos. I've said it in older videos a lot, but um, I went back there and they had, <coughs> oh, they had, two mix 17 trucks which when i was there when i found them first they had four mix 17 trucks but um yes yeah, someone bought the other two when i went there the first time they had the green grave digger earth shaker double decker and bulldozer <coughs> but i went back and I didn't have two of them which you'll see which ones they didn't have in a minute but first off i got the double decker uh when i made that update video i couldn't think of the name of this truck but um it is just double decker it's a brand new design for 2021. So also, sorry if you hear my chair creaking like this. Like, it's an old chair. I don't know if you heard that, but it's a really old chair and it creaks a lot and makes weird noises because it's really old. But anyway, let's rip open the double decker. Um, this is the first Mix 17 truck that I've opened. I've seen the entire case of Mix 17 because Mel had it. Uh, I do want to get the Grave Digger and the Dragonoid and maybe Zombie, and that's probably all I'll get from this case. If I site too. Well, that one came open pretty easily. So here's Double Decker. Jeez, I haven't opened a truck in a while. What's the poster? I'm curious. Although I'm not going to hang it up. I'm just curious. Yeah, that's Rottweiler. That's actually a pretty nice poster. I'm going with my bag of extra Spin Master posters. But here's Double Decker. Does the wheelie bar actually work? I remember when I opened a Mix 16 truck, the wheelie bar didn't work. Let's take this off. How do you take it off? There you go. It's been a while. Okay. Hey, give me a minute. So here's the truck. <clears throat> as you see, or as you can see, there's a car up here. There's a truck down here. So it's a Double Decker car, truck, whatever. It's got all different color rims, just like Salvager, which I don't have Salvager off the top of my head because it's in a box. Um, so yeah but anyway um great base black chassis it's got flat paint it's a really nice looking truck um glad i bought it it's pretty nice put that back there and the other one i bought actually i have to get something real quick because i forgot to grab it before i started the video all right i got it just had to grab something out of the bin real quick but um <clears throat> geez my throat will not clear up i'm gonna take a sip of my smoothie real quick Oh, <clears throat> all right, there we go. Anyway, um, yeah, so the other truck I got, I got the Retro Rebels Bulldozer, because how cool is this? I mean, Bulldozer hasn't been made since, what, 2014, 2015, maybe? And honestly, I think Spin Master, from what I can see in the package, did a great job, and we will be comparing it to the 2015 Hot Wheels one, because that's the newest one I have. Um, I have the 2013 one, I think, but it has no horns, and then I have the two small hub ones, but we will be comparing the two, and I, I do like the bulldozer truck, so I'm excited to get this open. Here's the truck, looking great. Here's the wheelie bar. It looks different than this one, actually. It's got, like, springs and I think that's just a shock, but it looks really cool. <clears throat> I believe if I'm pronouncing it, I believe it's the Wilman chassis that this is on. You know, that the maximum destruction was on. Because Tom had to drive this at one point, and I think he read the Wilman chassis. I don't remember. But anyway, let's compare the two. Um, obviously, this one is a little leaned forward because that's how the Spin Master trucks are. And this one's got, you know, a darker toning around the seams on the truck. Uh, I noticed that this one has a, a gold tooth and this one doesn't. I don't know. I don't remember if Bulldozer had a gold tooth or not, or if um, Spin Master just threw that on. But um, obviously, there's no Hot Wheels logo. 
bulldozer logo looks about the same. This has this bulldozer on the back, which I don't think was accurate. But this one doesn't. This one has the hair with Moshev.com. So pretty nice. I really like the dark coloring that they did on this one. This one has eyebrows. This one doesn't. Here's the front. Got the nose ring. Really detailed. This one's just kind of... It's pretty detailed still, but the nostrils aren't colored in. And there's detail on the front where this is just kind of engraved metal kind of detail. I don't know. But this one's got like painted details. This one's got the hair down here. Honestly, this one's just a lot more detailed than the Hot Wheels one. But um, yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And Series 155 will be coming most likely sooner. I mean, like I said, I'm still really, really busy. So yeah, um, keep expecting Series 155. It'll happen soon. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.